please for the love of god things be working hello everyone base of here welcome to a tuesday stream uh we didn't stream yesterday because uh i was getting constant black screens also my camera is moving it's it's like the uh the stream the camera arms are starting to sag which is a bummer so technical difficulties everywhere uh let's see so yeah i took yesterday off constant black screens of death i came downstairs this uh the stream today there was another one so i guess we're just gonna hope for the best but we're gonna be playing a game called sea of stars i believe i could be getting confused with, confused with one but i think i helped kickstart this back in the day because i think birch um showed it to me and i was like well i want to be a part of that uh, so we picked it up and it just got released last week i think it was um if anyone's been following along i know that uh we should be playing uh, Final Fantasy 16. I, I finally ended up calling it. I, I realized I, I, I don't even know what was happening in the story because I wasn't paying attention because I didn't care. <laughs> I didn't care. I don't care about freaking kingdoms fighting. That That is boring to me. If that's your cup of tea, go for it. But it, it doesn't intrigue me. I think it, it, it's dumb to me. Er, sorry, that that is too harsh of a word. I think the idea that there's kingdoms fighting over invisible lands or invisible lines is stupid so i i just i don't care about those plights or some essentially rich person trying to exploit his underlings to get more rich or more land it, it's stupid to me it's bonkers so like when when a story is very much revolving around that i know it's very real problems and stuff i don't care i think it's stupid that we're slaughtering I'm slaughtering my people because I want to be more rich. I think that's dumb. And I, I just, I don't, I don't find it enjoyable to play through. So, um, I realized that I don't have any idea what's happening in that game. And I was really only playing it for the kaiju fights. So I was like, ah, screw it. There's other games I'm actually looking forward to play. And uh, this is one of them, along with Dave the Diver. We got that coming up too. So we're going to play this one, Dave the Diver, like Monday, Tuesday. And then Wednesday, Fridays, we're going to be playing Baldur's Gate with Lee some more. I'm super excited. I don't remember what this game is about, to be honest. Um, hopefully, wait. Wait, okay. I, I see the voice mod thing working. I probably should check because after all the black screens and stuff, OBS fucked up the audio again. And also it fucked up my, fucked up my scenes. Um, they're not organized anymore. And they're like, you can put them in folders and stuff. Gone gone it's all it's all reverted so i hope things are okay anyways is it i don't know if this is a controller game or not uh looks like it's a controller game there's vibration uh oh this might not be charged uh oh what do you mean it's not charged it's been sitting over there i haven't used this in fucking a month uh oh That might be a problem. Oh no. If I have to play this keyboard and mouse, I'm gonna freak out. Kara, welcome to the stream. How you doing? I might have to play this keyboard and mouse. That's gonna break my heart. Or it's because it's just not picking it up because it's not connecting to my computer for some reason. So I love that. Um, okay, so E. Dialog bloops volume. <laughs> I kind of love that. Pixel perfect. I don't know what that means. Yep, we're gonna have to play with the keyboard for now. Sorry. Life is shit resort. Hey, th that's the best. Oops, we can ask for. See if Star Wars has two. Oh, shoot. I thought it was starting the game. Send you, sending you all the good vibes, my dude. Hopefully things start getting better for you. That's still fucking boiling water. It's been this, this fucking canteen. Like stays boiling for hours. Burn my tongue. Seer Stars has two main characters. Select the one who will lead the party. This can be changed later and does not affect the story. Cool. Oh, how do I have an Whoa! Cool, it changes. Look at look at his weapon. Valera? Is it Valera? Valera? A monk born on the winter solstice walks the path of the guardian goddess Luana. 
Zale. Is it Zale or Zali? I think it's Zale. A blade dancer born on the summer solstice walks the path of the guardian god Solon. I kind of like her. She, she's got a staff. I like me some staff. Hell yeah. You excited about this game? I didn't know if anyone um, besides Birch has heard of it. I, I believe I played the, the demo for when I kickstarted it. Welcome to the Great Archives Adventurer. I suppose curiosity brought you here. An important trait, to be sure. I am the archivist. An immortal versed in the ways of alchemy. Oh, hi. Well, perhaps you knew that already? After spending millennia cataloging the many events of countless timelines, I decided to return here to mull over everything I had seen. In my musings about the stories that fill these books and scrolls, I had a recent epiphany. It seems that in my haste, I may have overlooked the very thing I was hoping to find. As such, there is one special story I wish to revisit, one deserving of a witness. And should the, mis and should the mists of time allow a slight alteration, I believe the ray of hope that was once offered may yet bloom. Hey then, I hear you snoring. How come I am bobble isn't working anymore? That's unfortunate. So walk with me tonight and we will explore a tale of high adventure, of magic and deceit, of friendship, <laughs> friendship, friendship and wonder, but mostly a tale of heroism. One that I believe will offer a valuable insight to the search of the resolution to the throes of the Fleshmancer. The Fleshmancer. That sounds gross. <coughs> now I remain a bit lost amidst all these timelines and all their subtle variations. But I know just the one to make for a perfect starting point. Let us see what we find in there. Jump into a book? Ah, yes. Our story begins in the world visited by the Fleshmancer generations prior, causing much turmoil and leaving a mark that has yet to be fully cleansed. Somewhere on Evermist Island, two brave children of the Solstice are on their way to meet with an immortal spirit. In order to become fully fledged Solstice warriors, they will need to learn how to use magic without using magic. Oh. Okay. Ah. Whoa, look how cool she looks. Is this actually charging? It's worse. What the hell? It should be charging. Okay, well, slightly confused. A lot of people are saying it's like spiritual successor to Chrono Trigger, but from everything I've seen, it gives more Golden Sun vibes. Never heard of Golden Sun. Um, Chrono Trigger, however, did I play? I, I either played a little bit of Chrono Trigger or Chrono Cross. I own one of them on the PS3 or something. All right, we made it to the mountain trail. So far, so good. So the other mist lives somewhere here, huh? You think it's just another test? Could be, but it sure beats sitting at the academy. <laughs> I also that's another thing. I'm super stinking tired, so and I think I'm too tired to do voices. I apologize. And sewing. What you don't like sewing? Ah, yeah, I'm sure glad that's over with. Fly yourselves yourselves. For the will you weave into it should be your sole defense in times of greatest need. While the lessons taught here may appear to be lost on you, something deep inside is compelled to learn. Eh. They're mocking their sewing teacher. Is that what's happening? Hey, the sun will be setting soon. We should prepare to set up camp. There's something behind that tree. Let's split up and search for a good spot. No, wait. Okay, he's going to the left. I thought I was the leader. Time for some scouting. Ah, I was right. There was some hiding. I'm coming through. Yeah, we got that old JRPG music. Love it. Attack. Him. Stab or slap. Vulnerable. You vulnerable to my staff. Countdown. Ow. Ow. That was a lot of damage. 
What does that mean? Power. Ah! I did it! Brewgraves. Or Brewgovs? Brewgaves? Wasn't kidding. These feel easier to fight already. Let's see where this leads. This week I've been replaying the first Paper Mario. Yeti has told me so much about that. I think I, wa I watched the Grumps play it. Um, it looks fun. And aren't they remastering it or something? I heard that's a, a beloved classic. Look at him! Can you guys see him? No! Oh, no. He's making goat noises. Look at that boy! You gonna stomp on me? I'm gonna go over there and say hi. Oh. What are you doing? Okay. Ah! Oh, you want a box? The music slaps. Oh, I heal between fights? Ow. I was, I was just gonna say, that was like a third of my life. Ouch, tough one, huh? Let's try this. Skills. Crescent arc, moonerang. Smashes enemies in an arc. Lunar magic projectile that can bounce to mul multiple targets. Crescent arc. What? Yo, delete. We found the delete button. Oh, the remastering Super Mario RPG. Right. Have you found anything? Oh, those are glowing. Glowing berries. It's a dead end. How about you? I think you know, but the way to the top is definitely through here. The sun is setting. Come over. I'll get a fire going. I'll be right there. Can't wait for more tomato clubs. Tomato clubs? Tomato clubs. Come in. Look at this animation. It's so smooth. Love. And the pixel art is gorgeous. Look at the water. That's pixel art water. That's amazing. So clean. Bird. Oh. Scared him. If there's any enemies, I'm gonna say you didn't do your job. What's his name? Zale. Look at the boy. It's a slug with feet. Whoa! What the fuck? Oh, that noise is disconcerting. More modern games than be sprites and pixels. I, I love me some pixel art games. Ah, he coming! Wait, time out! Time out! I just want to be friends. No, wait. Oh, input lag. Fucked me. Didn't want to fight you. Maybe that's like the timing for the next time they attack. I don't know what that means. But in two turns, he's going to do that. Is that what that's saying? Super slash. C -c -c combo. There's a combo meter. I just realized. Dale, you left me a slug to fight. What the hell, dude? Okay, I want to hop these. Hop, hop. Word. Hop, hop it. There you go. Oh! King. Flying rock goats. Wait, that was the way I was supposed to go. Be right back. Come on. Eh. Oh, why did I think I could do it? go down there? I'm a dumb. It's fine. I just wanted to see what it looked like at the beginning again. Hi, bird. Can I? Aw. I want those berries. They're glowing. 
Oh, that's hot. Take off the lid. I if you said something, I missed it. Ha, huh, but doesn't it it doesn't beat the face you made the first time you tried smashing a sunball. Well, I can still hear the headmaster gloating. As I said, whether by paying attention in class or by recklessly attempting to hit a projectile with your open palm, you will learn the first rule of solar magic. To be fair, you did learn. Oh yeah, that only one only t that one only took once. Ever miss those years before training, just being kids, always daydreaming and getting in trouble, making mistakes. Are they saying they're not allowed to make mistakes? Mistakes? I'm sorry, Belair. I didn't mean. It's okay. I understand why he wouldn't want to join us after what happened. It's just. I wish he had said goodbye, you know? Oh, did they have another friend? After 10 years of not seeing his face, just to know that he's alright. That we're still friends. Okay, so we have a friend that we lost. Why did we have to get ahead of ourselves anyway? Oh, Garl. Book! There's a book! 10 years ago in the village of Moon Cradle. Look how small we are! My weapon will be something that hits really hard. And I'll pick a fast one. I, I don't know why I'm deciding to give them voice. It'll be unstoppable. You can get eaten by that book. It's a mimic. Imagine all the wonders we'll find after we leave Evermiss Island. I want to see the sleeper. You never heard of the sleeper? Stories say it's a giant serpent, and it's been sleeping curled up around the mountain ever si since ever before there were traveling historians to record it. No way. Sure is. It's super dangerous too. But don't worry. It can't wake up. Wake up! Apparently there's holes in the mountain and the wind blows through them and plays a melody that keeps it asleep. That's actually kind of cool. It's a neat idea. Oh. I want to see it too. That's the bell. Arlena and Brugaves are back. Brugaves? That was... I thought that was the name of that enemy. Quick, maybe we can catch them before they go to the academy. Oh. Buck! This is a save point? Save point. What cute music. Whoa. Why was it? You see it jittering? Oh, it's awkward. It's only when I go left. Ugh. Climb some rocks. Ugh. Dude, the animation is so smooth. Like, look at their walk cycles. It's so clean. Hello? Oh, I thought that was... Look at it. It's Stardew. These, crop... These crops are our main source of food. It's hard work, but I'm reminded every day when we all eat together. But the effort is well worth it. We got blue pumpkins. We got blumpkins. Oh, okay. I didn't think there was going to be this much to this little area. Woo. Look at how pretty this game is. Oh my god. Oh. Hey, wait. Oh. Okay, not pixel art anymore. There you are. Oh. That's Brew Graves. Playing in secret again. Playing in your secret hideout again. We were trading. I think I can use magic now. Is that so? Let's see it then. Whoa, you're cool. Wow. 
Come closer, Zale. Open your palm and concentrate. Can't teach him a rusting gun? What about you, Valeria? Have you been training too? Every day. I bet I'm stronger than you now. Hmm. I'm sure you are. Come here then. Punches her right in the face. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, easy now. I can't report to the headmaster if you knock me out. Yo, he does fireball. Let him go. That was awesome, Z er, That was awesome, Zale. I think that was the voice I gave him. You did it. Solstice Warriors. He's cool looking. If you are done with your babysitting duties, I would hear your report. Right away, headmaster. Okay. Can we go too? Uh. Sorry, I'm sleepy. Is that really my heart rate? Oh my god, that yawn really spiked my heart rate. Eesh. Believe me, once you enter Zenith Academy, you'll wish you hadn't. Let's go, Boo Graves. Boo Graves? <laughs> My hand exploded. He's a full moon is out. He's right. Wanna go to the Forbidden Cavern again? We tried already. I can't open it. Yeah, but last time we decided you hurt. Yeah, but last time we decided maybe the full moon could make the rune more sensitive. I'm sure it'll work, and Maureen will be so impressed he'll take you two in for training right away, and then we'll finally be allowed to leave the island. What if he gets mad and delays our training on Zen? No way. Well, we can worry about that after I open it. I mean, if I can open it. Alright, let's go! Would it be different if I chose Zale? Moon Cradle. Still hot. That looks like it started the Pokemon journey. Ooh, careful. Tall grass is dangerous. Hello. I know you wanted to catch Carolina and Brew Graves, but it's starting to be late. Bedtime soon, okay? It's weird. When I get close to something running left, it does that weird jitter. Something's glowing up there. Looks like a potion. Dude, look how stinking pretty! Oh my god! Look at that! Amazing. Remember, young ones, the Celestial w Willow was a gift from the Great Evil. Always treat it with respect. Holy crap. detail in the pixel art is amazing. Whoa. That looks like the exit, so I'm going to go in these other ones real quick. The, the jitteriness is awkward. I don't know what that is. I hope you're not getting into trouble again. Always. What I do. Oh, right. Went up there. Why is this glowing? See this? This little area? It's a little bit sparkly. <laughs> hey there, younglings. Are you still playing the little cave down below? Oh, is that. Well, I don't want to go there yet. I want to go check out this area. Look at like how her hair sways. It's so smooth and his his little bowl cut flaps. Oh. It cave down below, but that's above us. But 
that feels like that's the way I'm supposed to go. I'm gonna guess that those lights go out at some point. where we came from. Bring. Love that sound. Huh. The cave down below. Okay, maybe it is just go to the north. I can actually move through this area. That's kind of cool. Cool. So, so far, save points are pretty frequent. That's good. We made it. We made it. Time to stop for a snack. I'm not hungry. Yeah, we just left a few minutes ago. Look, it's not a real adventure if you don't eat a snack on the road. Plus, I made something special for the occasion. Yeah. Delicious. He cut the sandwich so it tastes better. Wow, oh, that's really good. Yeah, no kidding. Glad you like it. It's a gem. I used a bit of sap from the Celestial Widow. Are you not supposed to do that? You could get in trouble over that. Only if you tell. Uh. Ooh. Alright, how do I do this? Maybe like Carolina showed me? By opening her palm and concentrating. You got this, Valera! Is he a bad... Is our friend a bad kid? Or a bad person? In kid disguise? Did it! I knew it! Or wait. I knew it. It worked? I did it. <laughs> Look at her dance. I finally did it! So what now? Dad must have must have heard the bell ring. Should we just wait for him to show up? Might as well enter. It'll be our first adventure. I'm sussed out by him. Yeah, then the headmaster will know we're not afraid. This is exciting. Let's go. We're going to get in trouble, and then those two super cool people are going to save our ass. Slugs. There's monsters over there. Let's hide. Are they fighting? And they got little horns, and they're smacking them. I thought Everman's Island was safe. I guess that's only true for Moon Cradle. We should go back. They look dangerous. Yeah, good call. Ah! They're nowhere. They knew we were there. Watch out, there's another one. This is bad. We're surrounded. Maybe trying to use your powers? We're not ready for this. Hey. I don't know. Just try. Okay, let me focus. Wait, no. Monster. Get away. Time out. Let me focus. Watch out. It's preparing something. Come on. Come on. Blair, watch out. Yep. I was going to say, walk in front and get stabbed. Ah! Oh, God. That was a sad sprite. No. Oh. Oh, yeah. Wait. He got you in the eye? Fuck. I suppose that's better than the stomach. I can't see. There's no escape. It's about to attack again. 
lightning. Yo! So it was you. Headmaster, blah, blah, blah. As resourceful as, as you are reckless, I see. Headmaster! No one needs help. <laughs> Just beats him in the face with a staff. It feels better. I get win born in Moon Cradle. A regular kid. A girl needs is to not concern himself with the affairs of the Solstice Warriors. That was rude. I'm really sorry, Headmaster. It was all my idea. Hey. Be thankful that the only cost of this lesson was an eye, young lad. As for the two of you, if you are so eager to receive training, I shall oblige. Follow me. Oh, well, that's sad. Last night. Is that gonna be the big bad? Enemy with one eye. Charles man. Make sure to treat the wound and soothe the poor kid. He's not the complaining type, but if the pain seems to return, please send for me. Understood, headmaster. You will not see your friend for a very long time. If you have any parting words, speak them now. Very long time. Bye. Can he come with? Can he come stay with us? How long is very long? Like a week? Ah, uh, the eagerness of youth. It takes years to properly train Solstice Warriors. Oh, that's why. I thought it was because he was going to get trained. Or, um, healed. Years? No way! But. Your friends have much to learn. I would suggest you use that time to reflect upon what happened today. With any luck, it will help you forget any ideas of getting involved with a burden that is not yours to bear. Guys, don't forget about me. Never. We'll train very, really hard. Maybe it won't take so long. Aw. And animating like a staff perspective moving like that in pixel. Has to be a nightmare. <laughs> Welcome to Zenith Academy. In this ancient place of knowledge, you will learn everything you need to know in order to become the true Solstice Warriors. We've been waiting for for this for so long. When do we start? Oh. So I believe a proper introduction is in order. This punches them both right in the teeth. Careful now. Teleport? Oh, it's a ladder. Or an elevator. Welcome to the classroom in the sky. It's a small fucking ass classroom. Whoa, it's beautiful. I'm feeling weird resonance, like when I opened the forbidden cave. Good on you for noticing that. Getting close to the stars helps new recruits get er, acquainted, antiquated, acquainted with their innate magic. It shows great promise that you were able to feel it before. And Zale too, from what Arena told me. Oh, it was just a small burst. I have no idea how much potential they have. Is it going to be stronger because we ate the jam of the tree? It is probably for the best. Now, in the many years you will spend in Zenith Academy, you will learn about the duties incumbent upon, upon Solstice Warriors. Of the magic you are destined to wield and the evils is meant to cleanse. You'll learn how to fight too, right? Naturally. You will spend your days training and studying, but most importantly, sewing. <laughs> Sewing? That sounds boring. Oh, I can assure you that it is. <laughs> A mandatory task, nonetheless. All who would join our order begin by weaving their will into an enchanted piece of fabric, the staple of the Solstice Warrior. 
It is their most prized possession, guaranteeing light in the darkest places and a measure of protection against the minions of the Fleshmancer. But first, you must learn of your duties. Train until you cannot feel your limbs and then train some more. Once both your body and mind are ripe with potential, you will create a magic piece of fabric worthy of the very start. You will then be sent out beyond the Forbidden Cavern to meet with the Elder Mist, for it alone may officially grant you the title of Solstice Warrior. Sewing! I understand it is not what you were hoping for, but it is what is required for you... of you for the time being. Years of sewing! That would be all for today. The flesh master sounds kind of sexy. I don't think it's that kind of flesh shot. Flesh mancer. <sighs> You'll be spending a lot of time in these halls. So you should make yourselves at home. Your left is the training room. You are to go there first thing in the morning. Just above is the way to my chambers. It is off limits, of course. And to your right are the dormitories. Just make sure you pick a bed aligned with your innate magic. Feel free to look around when you go to sleep. Then go to sleep when you're ready. Good night. Okay. I'm going over here. Can I touch this? This is actually gonna have like RPG elements where I have to level up in like the training area. Hello. Well, there you are. We didn't finally decide that you were ready. Kind of. <laughs> we kind of forced our way in here. Okay. That's a huge fucking lock. I remember when our really and Boograbs were your age. They wouldn't stop running. Ah, I feel old now. Oh, I want that. Sewing basics. <laughs> Book. Save book. It's a bunch of old books. Lots of old books. Is that the only bed? No. Nope. A couple beds. I don't know which one is my alignment. I'm assuming this one because it's blue. Next morning in the training room. Good morning, fellas. No oh, graves. So you'll be our trainer. I wish. Eileen and I are leaving tomorrow, but the headmaster was kind enough to let us make your first day special. Are you ready for training? Go ahead. That's what I like to hear. I reckon these should be the well suited for the two of you. Got a training sword. We ain't even gonna check <laughs> take our thing. It's like Pokemon, but they gave it to us. Alright, let's get to work. Work it. More passion. More passion. More energy, more energy, more energy, more passion. You guys know that? That meme? <laughs> you got this, Blair. Don't give up now. Oh, look how fast she is. Come on, Zale. Keep up. I, I can do this. A9, 100. That's it for today. You did great. We did 100 push ups and 100 sit ups and a 10 kilometer run. 
every day. I'm becoming one punch man. Whew. That was a lot. Feel free to take a break. Arlene will see you in the terrace whenever you're ready. Arlene is ready to see you. She's waiting on the outside. Okay. Outside of the terrace over here. Oh. Oh, there you are. Ready to learn magic. She's got like horns. She looks awesome. You should feel as if something was scratching an inch far away from you. You must focus on the sensation and sensation and compel it to come closer. She looks like well that looks like she's pointing to Zale. I think it, I think it's working. Hey, you startled me. I almost had it. Now mine's gone too. It's okay. Just breathe slowly. Why does my mic feel like it's not picking up? Try to release only when you feel its current passing in front of you. If your timing is true, it will manifest. On three. One. Two. Three. I think I felt it. It tickles. Right there. You just did the hardest part. That was the hardest part? We could cast. I'm sure it's because we ate the jam. I'm sure your training will go well. But one more thing. No matter what the headmaster teaches you, remember that this is your life and... Alina! She's not very happy with him, is she? Since you are done onboarding our new recruits in the ways of magic, I would provide the briefing for your next assignment. As for the two of you, it is about time you tried that sewing kit. He kind of looks like, um beard um what's his name the guy in uh, vox machina the, the leader of Teldori. move along now sovereign uriel i think his name is and making a magic piece of fabric worthy of the very stars sure is a tall order yeah i have no idea what shape to even make at least the headmaster said we won't wouldn't get in Get it right the first time. Well, I'm bored. <laughs> okay. What are you doing? Let's walk around a bit. Okay. Did I accidentally make her do that? Where was it so I could save? Oh. I'm eavesdropping. You keep saying that, but the Fleshmancer left our realm for good when the Dweller of Strife was destroyed. Why can't they have a normal life? And you know the three of us can take the one of Wraith Island. Oh, take the one on Wraith Island. We don't need them. Prudence, Serlina. There is no telling what threats we may face in the future. But Laren Zale were brought to Moon Cradle by the Great Eagle. It is not the place of the Headmaster to question such things, and neither is it is yours. So how much is enough? What about Oyara? What about the twins? Rue Graves! Oh, he angry. Do not judge a sacrifice you, you cannot begin to comprehend. Huh? This conversation is over. They will study here while you carry on with your investigation. On the first eclipse after their training is complete, they will join us for the cleansing. Learn as much as you can until then. But... Let's just go, Brew Graves. And so they trained and they sewed for days, and then for months. Faster now! 
Oh, we got more sparkles. Focus and then release. And the longer a dweller is left to its devices, the stronger it gets. This makes patrol duty essential. Let one grow for too long and you have a world leader on your hands. That sounds cool. Against such a foe, even a legion of solstice warriors would be helpless. Since delaying only increases the chances of a world leader, cleansing always cleansings always target the strongest dweller known to us. Headmaster, if dwellers are immune to our magic, how can we fight them? Ah, that is why cleansings are always performed during a total eclipse. In these moments only, the dweller's weaknesses are exposed. How many dwellers are left? Just the one known as the Dweller of Woe. But we cannot know for sure. The Flesh Master just may have planted another seeds of evil before leaving our world. Thus, we must always remain vigilant. Headmaster? Yes, Flair? What happened to the Dweller of Strife? And who's Moyara? That will be all for today. I don't know what it be. A few weeks later, a sound of the night. Blair, wake up! Seal, what is it? I think I heard a voice coming from the entrance. What time is it? Time to go check it the fuck out. Who cares? <laughs> I just said that. Who cares? Let's go check it out. All right. Is this entrance? There's a pot with a note. Hey, look. Oh, it smells good. It's gonna knock us out. There's a note. Oh, it's from Carl. Adorable. Dear Valera and Zale, if you're reading this, it probably means I got caught. I'm writing this as a fail safe, but I hope to see you in person. I made cookies filled with the celestial willow jam you liked. He is a bad person. Watch. Ah. Keep reading. I'm doing everything I can to be ready to leave when you graduate. In the meantime, I hope your training is going well. Oops. Now the platform is almost up, and I can see Moraine in th is there waiting for me. He looks very angry. I'll try to drop the jar without him noticing. I guess this means I won't be able to try a visit. <laughs> that I won't be able to try a visit again, but I'm thinking of you every day, and I can't wait. I hope you like the cookies. Friend until the end of time. Garo. Aw. That's gonna be sad if he turns out to be the bad guy. Carl's the best. Let's go up on the disc to eat the cookies. I got a cookie jar! These cookies are- these cookies are amazing! I can't believe Carl was just there. I miss him so much. He seems well, at least for after- Seems well, at least, after what happened in the Forbidden Cavern. Bring him up and he smiled it away like the next day. Ah, you're probably right. But we can't let something like this happen ever again. At this rate, it feels like we'll never sow something good enough for the Elder Mist. <gasps> it will happen. We just have to keep on draining hard. Ooh, excuse me. So they trained and they sowed for years. Holy shit. And then they trained and they sewed some more. Until one day, they made a masterpiece sewing kit. Zale! Oh, I'm not doing the voice anymore. Zale, that's the one! Oh, I got a cape! I can feel it too. Hold on. All right, I think I got it too. Let's go see the headmaster. Yo! Oh, he's got a sash. I got a cape. Look at this go! We're real. We're real solstice warriors now. I think. 
Is everything going to be fucked up? Oh. Oh. Hey, bud. Look it. Check out my sash. We'll check out his sash and my cape. Isn't it dope? Headmaster, we think we're ready. Why, yes. The tingling of magic in the air has been building up for weeks now. Congratulations. Moving forward, there will be no more sewing. Fuck yeah. I can deal with that. It will soon be time for you to leave on your journey to meet the Elder Mist. But before we get to that, Zenith Academy has one more challenge for you. Oh, our visitors just arrived. Perfect timing. Hey! I'm glad you're still alive. Ah, you've both grown pretty strong. You want a box? Hey, it's good to see you. Arlena and Brewgraves are here to help you review the basics of combat. Check in with them when you will be... Then it will be time for your final test. Fuck yeah, bro! Did you go through the basics of magic? Yes! Teach me, teach me, teach me, teach me! When enemies prepare spells, you must do everything you can to prevent them. If you follow your senses, you can try dealing damage of the types that will break the concentration. Oh, that's probably what those symbols mean. Simpler spells will only demand normal attacks. But there can do blunt damage and zail his slicing. Let's see you break this one. So either... Dude, look at her! So magical. Bonk. Aha! Just like that. Now some spells will also demand magic damage to break. You can control your projectiles now. So let's give it a shot. Zale for sun and Valer for moon. Moonering! You're gonna get mooned. Oh. Oh! We're playing Pong! Uh, Hadouken! Oh! Well, <laughs> that was dope. Well done. Now you can sense your MP is a bit low. Oh, I used a... Oh, did me super powering it? Use more of his MP? Is that what happened? MP is low, right? To keep up pace in battle, you must remember to regenerate MP. Let's build it back up a bit. Let me hit with a normal attack now. Hit me with a normal attack now. Bonk! Ah, that's how you get it back. Did you feel that? You just got some MP back by attacking. In battle, awareness leads to victory. You must pace your spells with normal attacks to avoid ending up in dire situations with no MP available to get rid of it. And on the flip side, you should not hesitate to use spells when MP abounds. For a regular attack on a full bar is a waste of regeneration. Absolutely. The key is to experiment, keeping on varying, keep on varying your actions and find the rhythm appropriate for each battle. One last thing. All battle actions lock break. All battle actions lock breaking especially build your combo energy. Lock breaking. If you have enough, you can spend combo points to perform powerful actions. Combos cost no MP and are lost after battle, so you should never hesitate to use them. Orion told me you came up with your first combo attack. Show it to me. Oh. Dun 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 double team. Where'd the th oh the three came from? Uh, I think we generated mana. Yeah, you're strong, alright. Keep an eye on your adventures. You're bound to come across scrolls that will teach you some more combos. Scrolls teach me combos. Good luck with the exam. I'm sure you'll do great. Thank you. You're next. Want to review combat? Yep. Let's get started. Just attack me now. In any order. Use da to cycle through available characters. Party members can use their turn in the order of your choice, but they can only went once per round. Uh huh. And all your party members are on a cooldown. Round reset, they all become available again. Boxing time! Good. Focus is paramount whenever you perform attacks and skills. With proper timing, you can increase the damage that you deal and sometimes even score additional hits. Let's see. Press blah as the hit connects to increase. Oh! 
think I fucked up. That was too soon. Stay focused and press as a hit connects. Oh! Did he get two attacks? Okay, let's see that one more time. Yo, he hits twice! Ouch. Yeah, that's just a bit. Most of your attacks and spells can be made more potent with proper timing. Some also keep going with more hits you... Some also keep going with more hits until you miss. Yo! And remember, to think of timed hits as a welcome addition when you pull it off, rather than something you're supposed to do perfectly all the time. That's good to know. That they told us. So don't worry about it too much. Just keep on trying, and your sense for it will develop over time. Okay, now for timing your blocks. Let's see. Let's get the little guy in here. Wait, what? A little rock turtle. Nope, that's a spider. I hate it. To be efficient in battle, you must pay attention to anything that starts moving. With proper timing, you can reduce the damage of an incoming attack but or spell by blocking it. Get ready. Ow. Uh, yep, fuck that up. That was too soon. Haha! -ha! Be blocked! Good. Let's see that one more time. Yeah! That's how you do it. Remember to always stay alert. Some patterns will be harder to read than others. Sometimes even requiring multiple blocks. But don't be too hard on yourself. No one is expected to block everything all the time. It's not about getting it perfectly all the time, but rather building a growing sense for it. Just think of a time block as a welcome bonus whenever you happen to pull it off. The key to remembering... The key is remembering to read your enemies and to keep trying. Oh, one more thing. Aha! Wait, what? I blocked it! It even made the block noise! When a party member... Wow, that was rude. When a party member gets knocked out battle, you'll need to switch to a more defensive mode. KO'd allies will get back up on their own at 50% HP once all the KO stars are gone. One KO star is removed at the end of each round. The more you fall during the same battle, the more KO stars are there, so be careful. Interesting. If all party members go down, it's game over. Fight and survive until Zael returns. This is... What a cool idea for, like... Uh, resurrecting. I fucked up. Hey! And there you have it. Good work today. I'm sure their exam will be a breeze. Orin will see you to the final test. I'm sure you'll do great. We're gonna get jumped in the middle of this or something, huh? Are you ready for the final test then? We're ready! Then let's begin. Now kill each other. <laughs> the day has finally come. Over the years, Zenith Academy has tested you in many ways. We will now test you one last time. Have you prepared your vows? Yes, Headmaster. Then speak them now. Do it for Zale. <laughs> if he, like, proposes. Like, ah, shit. Oh, I thought it was those kind of vows. Hmm, okay. <clears throat> So that I may use my agility to cleanse this world and protect my companions, I will enter the world as a blade dancer. I choose the curved blade that is will not hinder my speed or reflexes. Welcome, blade dancer. Blink, blink. Come on, Valer. I did it. Now it's your turn. <clears throat> so that I may use my strength to inspire hope and eradicate evil, I will become a battle monk. I choose the staff for it won't break no matter how hard I strike. Welcome, Battle Monk. Fuck yeah, Battle Monk. Today you must demonstrate mastery of everything Zenith Academy has taught you. Your final challenge awaits below. You must kill the former masters. Please step aside. Now jump. <laughs> oh, before I forget, here's a little something to keep your health full. I got tomato club. Wait, what? Well, that came my helpful. Now with faith in your abilities and purpose in your actions, take a leap. I was right. And return as a new recruits of our order. I'm ready, Valer. Let's just go for it. Yup. Oh. Please splash. I would still bust you up. Oh, I was like, where's me? I thought he landed, he landed right on top of me. Do this music. Yo, 
this music. Oh. Yeah, I need to I need to install the soundtrack for this game. It slaps. She was just popping her knuckles. Dude, the music is so good. I'm gonna go up here first. Is this like our first dungeon or something? What's this? Cookie jar. No, oh, the cookie jar is empty. Oh. What the fuck did I just do? Oh. I get it. I didn't, know those, I didn't know those were raised up to my level. Found an ornate stone. down there oh I can't reset this something's glowing down there I can't reset those Hello! Get him. Wait. Skills. Hey, yeah. Let's fucking go! That was dope. Oh, I forgot. I can block those. Healing light, dope. <laughs> Doken. Oh, no close. Shit. Wait, what? I thought that was a door. Freaking man, dude. He is stinking gorgeous. Okay, so there's two different. Can I not go left? Because I chose. No. Never mind. Oh. Oh, shit. Got it. Isn't that gonna fuck this up though? Guess we'll find out. Never mind, I can't take it back. Hmm. Okay, so there's gotta be another one somewhere. Let's go uh, across this. Why didn't you just sit on it and fucking show offs? There it is. Ah! Mans! Nah. Oh, I'm out of MP. Okay, it doesn't reset after every battle. on him, bro. Heal myself. Feels a little bit better. Do, 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 do. 
the fade on her little cape is really pretty. Oh, are we fighting our way all the way back up? They haven't even been to the other side of the Forbidden Cavern yet. How could they understand? Do you think we should try it? So you don't think we should at least try to explain? You've seen how strong they are. Word will be a walk in the park. Let's see them off then. Am I hurt? Still hurt. Oh. Tomato club as in a sandwich. It is funny because it has like a pitchfork, pitchfork icon. It obviously, it means food now that we know that, but I thought it was a weapon. <laughs> hey, Fred! Got gross fingers. Exam mode engaged. Race goes out. Oh, fuck, man. I used it. I used the club. Oh, bull. Boom! Wow, that did hardly any damage. Resisted it. Ah! That was scary. Shuffle weakness. Oh, he's weak to physical now. Fuck! Oh. Never mind. He's weak to physical. <laughs> Why did I, my brain, I saw weakness, but <laughs> my brain thought uh, strength. Moon slash. Yeah, get slapped. On. He's picking on me. Weakness his son. I'm getting hadokened. Boom! We won! Easy clap. Level up! You guys know me. Oh, he gets a two. I kind of want to give him mana points because he has a heal. Yeah, I think that that's a smart move. As much as I want to do physical again, I think the mana is going to do well. Congratulations. You have been trained well. Return now to your headmaster. We did it. Can I talk to him again? Does the same thing. Oh. Hey, man, we did it. Congratulations, Valerizel. You have learned everything Zenith Academy has to teach you. Go talk to her, Garl. We did it. In record time, too. We must now learn of our ultimate power, the ability to use magic without using magic. Huh? But that knowledge is for the Elder Mist to impart. Come, the villagers have gathered to celebrate your departure. All our friends!
weekends. It is on special it is on special days such as this one that the citizens of Moon Cradle are reminded of the importance of their duties. Where's Garl? I just said that. I don't see him. Many years ago, Valer and Zale were delivered to us by the Great Eagle. Deliveries on two solstices in a row to boot. A very rare occurrence. Oh, I remember. Grand was so happy to get to meet Greet. Get to meet two more before she passed. Miss Grand. All of you have come together to nurture and protect them, just like your ancestors have done for so many children in the solstice before. <laughs> Valer and Zale. Step forward so that the good people of Moon Cradle might graze upon those who will soon join the ranks of the Solstice Warriors. This parading is ridiculous. Oh, we'll let the villagers have their fun. It's all they get. <laughs> Are you okay with this now? You know I'm not. Now, cheer with me as we send these young heroes out across the Forbidden Cavern to meet the Elder Mist. And then they're like, cool, we're going back home. Have an orgy in this bush. What do we do? I want to see Garl before leaving. I guess we have to play along for now. Fingers crossed that we can come back after meeting the Elder Mist. Fingers and toes. Blair, Zale, you must undertake this journey on your own now. You will not fail, Headmaster. Go now. Through the forbidden cave and atop the mountain trail to seek audience with the Elder Mist. Learn how to use magic without using magic. And you shall then enter the world as true solstice warriors. May Luana's might protect you. That's my goddess, right? May Solon's light guide you. Here. This should keep you fed for a little bit. That's more clubs. And if your adventure feels a little tough, you could take a look at these. Amulet of Storytelling. Sequent Flare. You just received your first two relics. Find them in the relic section of the game menu. Whether you prefer a lighter challenge or are looking to push yourself to the max, relics offer a range of options. There's bound to be more to find. Okay. Remember to keep an eye out for merchants. Selling any valuables you find will, ki will keep you well fed and well equipped. Now, wherever your adventures take you, you must remember your first assignment. After the Elder Mist sends you out into the world, you must secure passage to Wraith Island in time for the next eclipse. And do keep on training, for a dire cleansing awaits. I still can't believe he wants them fighting a dweller already. That's Moraine for you. We weren't much older than the first time. Yeah, but we'll find a way. Safe journeys to may you cleanse the world. May you cleanse this world! Okay, uh... Oops. Ah, left control is back. I'm guessing I have nothing for any of them. Ooh, get more, get more skills. That's neat. Oops. And you know, storytelling. Max HP plus 100 and auto heal. Oh, these are the same things he was saying. Successfully timing hits and blocks causes a star flare to fly out of the character for clear as day confirmation. The input was properly timed. Recommended for those preferring stronger feedback while closing in on the mastery of certain moves. Sure. That's nice. Hey, Birch, welcome to the stream. How far are you? Let me in. played up to the first oh my brain saw first and uh thought it said final and then he got frustrated oh no 
Surfer is easier now. This time we make it through. Slugs! Where's Garl? Why wasn't he there? What is this? Treasure chest! Okay. Go up and around. This is very, uh... Makes me think of Final Fantasy VII with the, um... The undead cave. I forget what they're called. Run! Run, you can't catch me! They catch me. Ouch, I forgot. Aha, look at me go. The power of the Hadoken. Blam! Wow, he just deleted them all. Okay, want that? Maters. Dude, the art. I'm constantly just flabbergasted. It's so pretty. Up, up. Ah! Oh, ah. oh, fun little puzzle. Fun little puzzle. I get it. You would make this easier, Zale, if you just stay onto that. Oh, it locked it in. Okay, that made it. I thought I was going to have to time this. Look at the shimmy. <laughs> Present. Ooh. Defense and magic defense? Sure. That should, uh... I unequip. E. Thirty adventures agree. This is best, the best. How do I unequip? Oh, like that. Oops. Gotta keep the healer alive. Keeping the healer alive keeps the party alive. Ah, oh, shit. Shit. Oh! Ah I had no idea how to block that one. Just delete him. What's this? Okay, that's gonna lock that back into place, I think. Oh, I want that. go the clever puzzles forbidden cavern key did we find another path i don't remember is that is that the key oh hold up
Is that the way? It's gotta be the only way. Or that, it's gotta be, because that's the only way I found, right? Can you just jump off? No. There we go. Open? Shit. Okay. Hmm. Need to sneeze. Excuse me. There's nowhere else to go in here, was there? Wait, was there a door? Hold on. It wasn't a door, it was the key. There we go. Ooh. Mushroom soup. Fuck yeah. But this thing. Learn combo skill mending light. Combos. Solstice strike mending light. Yeah. And the solstice strike did cover some MP. That's pretty sweet. I got another gate. Bleaching thorn. Normal text heal. Hell yeah, dude. Great for her. You still at work here? Oh, shit. I didn't know it was one of those. I thought it was gate. I do like running from these and making them try to chase me. Oh, I'm surrounded. Fuck, I'm terrible. Ow, I'm real terrible. No, you can't do it too. I don't know actually how to do this. She gone dumb die. Aha! Be deleted. Oh shit. I thought I was the jumpy one. Be healed! Yes. Okay. Got the first one. Missed? Oh shit! I thought he was going after him. Jumped out of the way. I was like, nice dodge! No, it wasn't the target. You stop picking on her. Fuck! Can't do block the second one. Save my life. Fucking combo skill, god damn it. Yeah! Ooh! My arm powers combined! Oh! Ho, ho! Huge! Full life! I want this. Got a meter. Device is broken. We can't activate the bridge. There seems to be a detour through there to the left. Worth the shot. Making our own road. Can I make a camp? 
and feels cozy and warm. This is a, like a heal point. You can set up a camp? They didn't really teach us what that does. Shame we didn't get to see Graal before leaving. Interesting. That boop sounds like um the underwater levels in Donkey Kong Country. Look at this sleepy Jada. He finally decided to join the stream. Last fight. Yep. Lair. Sounds big. Get ready. Whoa, did you see your awesome looking sprite? Oh, it's a worm. Ugh. That is quite the sphincter. Yo, there's music though. Get moon ringed. Fuck. Yo, hums the power. Vulnerable. Oh, right. My oh, thank God I didn't get poison or anything. I gotta remember to block shit. Aha! Like that. That was a lot of damage. Ah! Ah! Fuck off! Wow. Okay. Fuck. Get out of here. And I can't target or time his. Oh shit. I should have switched my order. It's fine. <laughs> Boss slug. Boss bug. They gonna explode? Do, 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 do. Combo time, baby. Uh, maybe we'll wait. Yeah, get crescent arced. Ha <laughs> Nothing. Ah. Ah. Stop it. He's just self healing himself this whole time. Wrecking shit. Out of here. Combo time. My powers combined. Sun, moon, healing powers activate. Yeah. Oh. Oh no. Do my skills count for that? OK, 
counts as a hammer. Fuck! Oh. Acid bug bombs! There's lots of them. No, oh, I wish I had the other one. It's fine. Fuck, I'm terrible at that. I don't know what want to know what these guys do. Alright. Fuck, dude. Why? Stop it! Oh shit, I should have used his power. life do you have? My god. Oh, and I had a full max combo. Boo. Yeah, the music for this game is freaking awesome. This is not the boss I was stuck on. Our first big one. We did it. We did do it. Looks like there's a way out over there. Mountain shouldn't be much further now. <gasps> oh, presents. Found some money. Oh, hell yeah, dude. Can we give? Ah, oh, yes. Yes. Should we just leave now? Nope. No other secrets? What is in here? normal things are starting to move he's got the ring again i'm eager to see what these two can do eager and impatient too for now we wait three you know what to do it'd be great if they they had the number of eyes that the name was Alright, there's three ways to go. It's farming music. Hey there, were you looking for anything in particular? I sure you sell me some shit. Ooh, look at the damage. Question is, can I just find these throughout the world? Wait, can you grow shit in this game? Nice. That, I love that. Like, you can equip it and then immediately sell it. It's great. Thanks, buddy. Appreciate you. Is there fishing in this game? Holy shit. Look at the fish! I, I pushed F5 to save my- Ah! You can swim. I pushed F5 to save my game. Like this was fucking Boulder's Gate. Catch him! Get him! Fish! Ow! Huh? <gasps> Picnic basket! Yep! Get the fish! Get the fish! It's an octopus. Get him. Get the squid. Will you send me a fish fishing pole? 
Did you have a fishing pole and you just didn't see it? Did not. Well, I guess we'll see you later then. Okay. Close the shrine. Save book. It's locked. Okay. Maybe I have to clear what's in here first. All right, made it to the mountain trail. Isn't this where we were at the beginning? So far, so good. So the Elemis lives somewhere here, huh? Oh, oh. Oh, is this current? Because we, we had the time drop. Now we're caught up to where the beginning was, I'm assuming. I really hope we'll get a chance to return to Moon Cradle after this. Ugh, excuse me. What if we're sent out into the world right away? Yeah, I don't know. I just wish Garl was here. We could, cer we could certainly use some Celestial Willow Jam to go with the this awful bread. <laughs> the dream. Huh? Who's there? Show yourself. Celestial Willow Jam. Yeah, it's our man. Look at him. Oh, I'm so glad. I've got some right here, guys. I even picked some mushrooms. You won't believe this soup I'll make. Oh, this is amazing. Look how happy he is. No. Oh, and I found some herbs in the Forbidden Cavern. Don't you just right. I love him. He's my favorite character. Carl! But you didn't really think I was going to let you go on the adventure without me, did you? Carl! Give him a big hog. Yeah! Oh, look at this three. It's so good to see you two again. Look how wholesome he is. He looks so strong now. Hey, why didn't you show up for our departure? Are you kidding? There was absolutely no announcement. As soon as I heard everyone gather, I went to a hideout to pack my stuff, but you left so fast. Guys, I'm so pumped for this journey. I knew all I know all about survival now. Not getting poked in the eye. Fishing and gathering and cooking and... What's wrong? You can't actually come with us. We just wanted to say goodbye. We're on duty now and it's pretty dangerous. Aw, oh, man! No! You can't mean that. We've always talked about how we'd all leave together after your training. I spent, I spent all those years practicing in our little cave. I'm ready. Look, I may not have any special powers like you do, but I'm built strong and I've been preparing. This is awful. This here is my shield. I'll be a defensive fighter. No, a warrior cook. Fuck yeah, warrior cook. Oh yeah? I was gonna say, he can be a cook. I like how his music popped back in. Sure am. I've been reading a lot too. See, most of the monsters you're going to face won't even be flesh bands or minions, which means anyone can fight them. You sure about that? Totally! Have you seen any yet? You haven't seen any yet, have you? No, but I know when to step aside. Don't worry. Plus, you can't really travel the world with just a few sandwiches. What were you thinking? That's... yeah. See? You need me. You just do your soulless warrior duties and I'll keep your bellies full. Fuck yes, dude. He needs to be protected at all costs. Garl, deal? Okay, deal. Oh, I'm so happy. Me too. No way. This is awesome. They're just making you get attached to him. And they're going to steal him out from under us. All right, I'll start the kettle. We have so much, we have so much catching up to do. Garl, the warrior cook. Yes! The warrior cook. We let him cook. This is amazing. And so apparently after we meet this Elder Mist, we'll be able to use magic without using magic and be sent out into the world. That's all we've been told. I guess finding our own way is the final step of training. Our first assignment is to get to the Wraith Island in time for the next eclipse. Wow, that's a lot. Your powers sound so cool, though. Can't wait to see them in action. He is a bad guy. 
He's three, isn't he? What about you, Carl? Oh, what? And it, what or he's one. Oh, it was pretty uneventful, to be honest. All I did was train and learn the skills I thought would come in handy. Every single day I was hoping to see you come out. I'm sure glad no one told me it would have taken 10 years. Yeah, we miss you too. It's not fair that we were together and you had to do this on your own. Well, we're all together now, so it doesn't matter anymore. And I can't wait to explore the world. I want to taste everything. Hey, this soup is unreal, by the way. Right? Uh-huh. So how did you, much food did you pack? Just enough for a few meals. It's better to travel light, and there's ingredients everywhere if you look, know where to look. And who knows what we'll find. It's all part of the adventure. I didn't go try now, Valer. See that bush right there? It's full of juicy berries. All I have to do is pick them. Oh yeah, dude. Let me go get them shiny berries. Delicious. Delicious. I got three shiny berries. Perfect! Now I'll just make some jam with the berries you picked. Just interact with the campfire and get ready to cook. Fuck yeah, dude. It didn't feel right without a girl. Campfire feels cozy and warm. Cook time! Air jam. Yes. It's some berry jam. 5 MP for an ally. You did it. See? You're a natural. You can eat that jam later when we need to heal up. These are the tips, Carl. That's going to come in handy for sure. Don't mention it. Okay, I'm ready for some sleep. What if I went north? Same here. And nothing but the stars above us. I'm loving this life already. Carl, I'm really glad you're here. They're really building up your attachment. I don't trust video games anymore. I was just about to say that. You two guys, I wouldn't want to be anywhere else. Well, good night then. Good morning! Oh, he's a morning person. Shit. One strike against Carl. He's a morning person. You all ready to go? I'm excited to see what this Elder Mist looks like. Should be straight up. Let's keep hiking. Book. Sluggy Wogs! Get him! Get him, Warrior Cook! I believe in you. Look at him wiggle. Aha! You've been broken. Haha! <laughs> Get punched! Ow. I can't time those other ones for some reason. Whoa, maybe, or maybe it's because I'm getting input lag because that was some nasty stuff right there. Wait, you can't jump across that? There you go. Vasquez. Displays non-boss enemies HP in combat. Oh, that could be helpful. Why not? Oops. Yeah, I'm getting some... Oh my god, input lag. Let's see if I have... Anything running that could be causing this issue. We go. Oh, kick that down. Heck yeah. And a big old ah! scared me. Look how happy they are.
I pushed. Oh. Um. Enter works, so hopefully. That means I have to relearn all of it, though. That sucks. Ow! I thought you were going to go after her. Carl throws an enemy to another position. Carl throws a snack at a friend. A medium heal. <laughs> Catch! Snackies! Apple! Haha! <laughs> oh, medium heal! That was his whole life! Amazing. How come I don't see their... their life? Oh, this is right there. Oh, boo. Do, 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 do. One's been deleted. Oh shit, she's the hammer. That's right. Woo! Catch a snack! Dude, that's a huge heal. I don't know what it's talking about. Yo, do all... Oh, I thought he was gonna, like, do a dance or something. That'd be great. Just a vibe dance. Ow. You just healed that, asshole. Okay, but what's down here? Oh, glowy. I want this. Got a tater. Oh. This is the direction I went for her, right? Any enemies show up over here? Can't make that jump. A little, a little tiny shortcut. There's glowing stuff down there, and I need it. Actually, how do I get it? Can I fall up here? <gasps> Got it. Maters and bell peppers. I hope this controller isn't like busted. Hmm. Oh, well, it's been charging, so hoping for the best. saw my hands up an input lag dude it's awful i don't know why it happens it's so frustrating fuck you game bar why are you always trying to run i've disabled you Mm. 
Probably didn't do anything, but oh! There you go. Oh! Can you actually fall on those? That'd be kind of funny. Oh! More bell pepper. Hello, sneakies. Boo! Oh, you can get preemptive smacks. just did it automatically love that bell peppers for me I actually hate bell peppers I think they're disgusting hello what are you doing in here Hey there, were you looking for anything in particular? Oh, it's a sale man. I can sell him the berry jam. Wait, let's... Hey. Basic salad. Boring but healthy. <coughs> Beatable when the tomatoes are just right. Well, that actually feels a lot. A nice little salad. Hello, friends. No, me first. Fine. Fuck, I can't hit them at all anymore. Yeah! Ah. Yeah, got him. Ow, ow, ow! He hit me so hard! Actually, probably could have so used a little combo skill. Still probably should have used it. It's fine. Oh, in the misty mountains. Oh. oh I didn't even think I could jump down there. Chaudry. Can make a shark tree board. I don't like killing these guys. They're, they're just happy prancing around. <gasps> you leave him alone. Reach in, grab a little apple. Delicious. That's OP. Oh, so close. He has like one life.
Like he just gets like a sucker punch in there. It's great. Level up! Woo! Hell yeah. Ooh. Oh, it has a rotating. A lot of hit points. Normally I would go for defense, but... Hmm. Yeah, look at it, we get level home up. This makes me happy. bad if he dies so we're giving him life got some chicken wings move what i hit him first to hit the middleman too what the heck that's unfortunate oh she's hurting let's see what this does get out of here <laughs> what ow Requires two levels of combo. Got it. Sandwich. Fuck. Getting clubbed. Ow. No, oh, I was a, wish I was going to get another combo. Heal time, sucker. It <laughs> just stands right next to the enemy for a second. Yeah! For life, baby. He did a little backflip. Well, happy goat. Cabbage? Maybe it's lettuce. Probably lettuce. Okay, so there's the cave. That looks like the solstice cave because it's got two of the lights. Look at him! Sometimes it... Do I not? I don't... I'm a little confused. his life.
Eh, why not? Yoing. Ooh, big heal. Ow. They're all just punching the shit out of him. Okay, yeah, it's just a shortcut. Okay, but what's this? Ooh. Hello? Oh, oh, oh. oh shit. Did I go the wrong way? Children of the Sosas have come to the Rite of Passage. I also sense one who does not belong here. Don't you say that. Is he brave or foolish? Oh, let's find out. Oh, you're silly looking. I love you. Welcome, young and bad you guys, to the sacred pot. Nice to meet you, Elder Mist. My name is Garl. Why, what a gregarious one you are. Enthusiasm is certainly welcome in this place of meditation. But its rights are not meant for the common folk. Children of the Solstice, step forward. Ooh. Why is he an owl? Spoiler owl! Ooh, ooh, ooh. It seems you show great potential indeed. We have you weaved your wheel into celestial fabric. We have Elder Mist. And come closer and let them be imbued by the sacred pun's magic. I shall now pee upon you both. That is the sacred pond. Ooh, a tremendous resonance. Wear them with purpose, for they will augment your innate magic. You shall henceforth have light in the darkest places and protection against the minions of the flesh, Mansa. He has the most annoying voice. <laughs> I don't feel any different. You just gotta believe. Yeah, me neither. Oh, rest assured, the ability to use magic without using magic has taken root in you indeed. What does that even mean? And how does it work? It arises from need. In the many battles that await you, victory will often demand that you use of the more offensive magic than one can sustain through spells alone. That is why attunement to live mana is paramount. Live mana? Ooh, but it allows your attacks to draw from the magic bestowed upon you at birth. And judging by the resonance you create, this power should even extend to your traveling companions. Nice. You are ready. Live mana will start manifesting for you the next time you enter battle. Are you ready for your final test? No. Other mist. I'd like to go with him. Ooh. The Elder Mist Trials have never been undertaken by anyone but aspiring Solstice Warriors. But I want to go with them, please! Interesting. You are the first of the common folk to ever make such a request. He sure is peculiar one, no doubt limited when it comes to combat, but the warmth of his heart. Could he bring it back? Perhaps we should try to find out. I will allow it! All right, thanks, Elder Mist. Consider it a test of your ability to act as a companion to the Solstice Warriors. I won't fail. We are ready. Then close your eyes and take a deep breath, because you are about to drown in this piss. Am I going to be able to go to that other cave that was down below? Shit. I fucked up. Welcome to the Elder Mist Trials. To pass this final test, you must bring three big relics together by completing their associated challenges. The monsters that will try to stop you are immune to physical attacks, and their use of offensive spells is prohibited. What? But how then? Oh, that is why you must use magic without using magic. Live mana can boost your battle actions with a portion of your magic attack. Embrace this power and your training will be complete. Oh, I have to try that. The trials await. Should you wish to return for a while, simply close your eyes and concentrate next to where you just appeared. Godspeed! Okay, I want to go back out.
I want to go do that the cave first. Also figure out what the fuck this is about. Well, that's going to make a bridge. Oh, book input. That was like six seconds. What the hell, dude? How come I can't loot this one? Maybe it's because of input lag. Okay, let's go check out this cave real quick. Did not expect you to be back. Fuck! I am so bad at that. I can nail pretty much all the time though. What could this be? Ah, fuck. All right. Guess we gotta go do the trials. Shimmy, 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 shimmy. Back in we go. Hello, friend. Look at him floating. Attack did nothing. The spell would probably do it, but we can't use them here. Because that's the part where use magic without magic comes in. But how? Some little orbs appeared when I attacked it. Maybe that's live mana? Maybe. I feel a kind of pull towards them. I feel it too. Let me try something. Boost. What the fuck? What the fuck? Whoa! It worked. How does it feel? Like power. So if I attack, it should do magic damage now. What? What the fuck? Okay. That was amazing. I want to try it next. Boosting has been unlocked. Regular attacks will now generate life mana. Hold left shift and press blah to absorb a charge and boost. Up to three boosting charges can be stacked, each adding a portion of your character's magic attacks. Oh, snap. Magic attack stat for the next attack should do increase its power. In the case of regular attacks, the character's innate magic damage type, if they have one, is also added to the top of their weapon's damage type. Whether you're dealing with an intri intricate lock pattern need to make your next healing spell really count or just want to deal more damage remember to boost okay so i can just do it willy nilly is that what i'm understanding gross sandwich 60 hp Yeah, let's make a roast sandwich. It's cool. It actually shows you like cooking it up. Oh yeah, bruh. Oh, I can make another one? Damn. I don't, like, oh, he, on he only can hold a certain amount. Okay, he won't do that yet. All right. Challenge number one! Maybe? Oops. Can you pop up this? Thank you. Oh, 
Found a shiny pearl. What's the shiny pearl do? What is it? Shiny pearl. Maybe, maybe it's just something I sell. Whoa, that was a long jump. He's going to die. Looks all beat up. Mm, apple. I, I, I chose boost. Did I not? I chose boost. There it goes. There you go. Superpower. Yeah, get him. Got some candies. The bear. Need some bridges. The crystal. Okay. Vape crystal. something up hmm I thought there was like gonna be three bosses or something to read okay maybe we can't do the center one yet until both the side ones are done sneaky 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 mine the armor. More defense, more magic defense, huh? Hey, go, buddy. He's got a cauldron in the lid. I love it. Makeshift weapon with sentimental value. Love it. Our slappage coming through. Fuck, 
I can't block that one. the lava crunk aha so it, you can hit them as long as you just swing before the combat starts there it goes Do 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 font font. There we go. Hey, kick it down. Hello. Okay, but why? Can't jump across this, right? No. You can go over there. Those are huge feathers. Is this where like the great eagles came from? Oh. Get it. This. Nice. Nice. Very nice. Ah. That was less nice. So you can miss jumps. It's good to know. Oh, I missed. Shit, that, that's gonna suck. Ow. Haha, no attack for you. Or you. Crystal? Crystal! Look at all these candies we're getting. Nope. I this one feels shorter. Okay. All right, let's see if this opened up. Doesn't look like it. not see that. To get this artifact piece, you will need to answer three questions correctly. Let's see how well you learned. Of these two actions, which one generates HP? Attacking. Making sure you understand the game. school you went to Zenith Academy Solstice Elementary I'm gonna get that that's gonna be mine I'm gonna put it in my pocket mushroom scramble I like scrambled eggs but with mushroom whoa that, the rope was messing with my eyes
In very important solstice warrior duties, destroy dwellers. Become vulnerable during witch natural phenomena. Let's. I pay attention. I learn. Huzzah! No fights in that one. Just want to make sure you understand the game. The ball. Do a quick shave. This is our last chance to prepare. Do you feel ready? Yes! I hope so. Adventurers have finished the preparations. Huh? I am the evil one. I see you understand the power of live mana, but can you master it? We shall see. The use of spells is now allowed again. Fight me, bitches! Oh my god, for serious, fight me, bitches. Oh my god. Looks awesome now. Face me, children of the solstice! the fuck? Can I target anything else? <gasps> I can! Punch! Sword active. Ow! Fuck! Okay. That was sword active. Okay. Give me that power. Ah! Okay, that I like less. Okay, I can't target his hand. Catch this shit, sucker. Oh shit, I need to I don't even recognize that as an attack I wonder if I should fix the See if I can fix the controller because If I get input lag, this is gonna suck Ass Catch No, she already went. Shit, I fucked up. Fucked up. <laughs> you asshole! You're not supposed to do that. Slash. Okay, maybe. Okay, I think I figured it out. Eat his damage. Oh! Ouch! Got smooshed. Well, you actually can't help her up, huh? No, no, no. Ah, oh, shit. Of course she's down. Bullshit move. Boosted.
Stop healing like a bitch. Okay, is this still gone? Okay. Oh, he can get. Wait, for serious? You can eat a Hadoken. Boom! It shrunk right before it let go. Can we get a super combo on? More power. More power. We need. We require more power. Oh. No, no. Aw, oh, dicks. One, two, three. Oh, you ain't ready. You don't know how much you aren't ready. <laughs> it did less damage than I thought it was going to do, but it's still cool. Put your sword away, bitch. Oh, wait. He doesn't. Ah, I wasted it. Put your sword away, bitch. Less damage than I expected. Ow, I wasn't paying attention. Shit. No, stop feeling better. I did not time that well. Ah, shit, you asshole. Oh, I should have probably boosted it. Fine. It fucked. Wow, that did nothing. Stop healing yourself like a bitch. Only I'm allowed to do that. Stop smashing him. This is Apple. We'll do some uh, little protective thing going on here. No, stop it.
Yeah, get broken. No, don't do that. Uh... No. No! Fuck. Oh. That's enough of those things on the ground, huh? Fuck. terribly timed oh that was terribly timed uh ninety fuck Dokened. Boom! Suck my white ass, man! Let's go! Oh, I had max combos. Shit. Ah, for me to burn. Oh, a bright future awaits you indeed. Belair, Dale, and name you Solstice Warriors. I knew it. Right. I knew it. You're the best. Ah, there it is. We did it. I have consulted the mists of time during your trials. When you're ready to leave this place, find me back at the sacred pond and I will tell you of your respective, respective prophecies. You kind of hate me, why? <laughs> oh, was that the fight? The one that was bothering you? Then you will be sent out into the world. Ooh. Don't take too long now. <laughs> you just gotta get good. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> I think the trick is um, you, you gotta take out his sword because it could have been coincidence, but I think it was like the guard scorpion in Final Fantasy 7 where if his sword is active and you hit his body, he immediately counterattacks with it. So you gotta take out the fucking sword. I think you just wanted it over and got impatient. Fair. Yeah, because every time he healed, it just... It's like, ugh, all that damage I did is back. You know? Where am I going? I'm leaving. Do I need to heal? Set up camp. Talk to my friends. Make some snacks. The 
This life mana thing is unreal. I want to boost all the time. Time to use our new powers to cross over the big statue atop Mountain Trail. Oh, I should check to see if uh his um food ability or his skill actually uses the food we cook. Yeah. He gives me, um, this guy. He makes me think of, uh, I want Oppenheimer and Heimerdinger is both in my brain, and neither of those is the right word, but it's, um, Red's human uncle, the wizard man. I, I can't remember his name. Good morning. The time has come to begin your journey. Morning. It's middle of the night. Ah, uh, yes. I suppose your friends should address that. Address what? Bring us the dawn! You can do that? Whoa, no way. Oh, all it takes is for you to stand on the celestial rune. And then what? Something inside of you already knows. Right this way. Now concentrate and bring us the dawn. Use E and Q while standing on the sister. Oh, no fucking way. Mean. Mean. Neat. How did you do that? That's the coolest thing I've ever seen. Oh, oh, oh. Because he says, ooh, ooh, ooh. In Final Fantasy VII as well. That's probably, and he's got the big bushy white hair. Very similar. That part is always easier by simply going for it. Now in your travels, you will sometimes find mechanisms and seals powered by magical rules that react to the time of day. They were put into place by solstice warriors who came before you. Some conceal artifacts meant to help future members of the order such as yourselves, but others seal away evils that are far too powerful to confront. Whether or not you look for these artifacts and challenges will be entirely up to you. Now, your journey can be again. Come and meet me beyond this chasm. How do we get across? By using your powers, of course. Meet me on this other side, and as a farewell gift, I will share with you what I could read in the midst of time. Try using the crystal to charge the smaller rune on the ground above and see what happens. This room? Oh, that's fucking cool, dude. Oh, that's fucking cool, dude. Love that. Oh, right. <laughs> I fucking love that. That's amazing. Hi, friend. Ugh. Ooh, big hand. Are you gonna fight me again? Hello. Talk to me, please. There he goes. Oh, are you ready to be sent into the world? Turn in, Pop Smurf. Let us see you off then. But first, your prophecies. I will speak them to your minds directly, for they are yours and yours alone. There, a step forward. You know, he's just gonna awkwardly stare at them for a minute. In order to reach your full potential, you will first need to stare at the night inside of you. Thank you, Elder Mist. But let her approach. When the time comes, you will be the one to create paths on water. Understood. Girl! Uh, don't you dare say I have nothing for you. I get one too? Awesome! You must be mindful of your limitations during this journey. 
<laughs> he sets it back with his brain. You got it, Elder Miss. Wow. This is not a conversation. Oh, my bad. Carry on. I fucking love Garl. They're going to kill him. I know it. Miss are unclear in your case. It appears your heart might be warm enough to soothe a long tormented soul. Please don't kill him. I love him. Okay, I'll do my best. You have now learned everything I could teach you. I am sending you to Sleeper Island, where you are fated to meet a crew bound for adventure. Make friends with them and they shall help you reach Race Island in time for the next eclipse. To activate this giant, give it the name Zertel. Stole. To be sent to Sleeper Island. To return here, simply go to Zertel and speak this one's name, which is... Zertel, cool. Ah! Yo, he just fucking yeeted us! Well, I suppose we won't be seeing each other for a while. Ooh. He just fucking yeeted us. Probably just a, a smooth pace on the back of that. Well... <laughs> spaceship that he just made. And so it, and so it was that Valer and Zale were sent off to begin their journey with their best friend and warrior Cook and Toe. In their quest to get to the Wraith Island in time for the eclipse, they would soon come to grips with two very powerful wizards. One by anger beset, the other of life bereft. Oh god. Oh he's cool. Look at these guys. They're fucking awesome. Oh hey, that was awesome. The other miss wasn't kidding. What a ride. Who knew the world was so big? They're just playing ball with him. So what now? Find a boat, I suppose. The ground level then? There's only one way we can go from here anyway. Yo, bud. Not bud. These are mine now. Oh! Present. Need it. Need a save book. I want that. Ahaha! I found 90 gold! I'm rich! Okay, I need to get back up there. Feet noises. Hello? This is mine too. Solstice Mage Ring. Wait, what? Oh. Party members recover 1 MP when they time a block. Like all party members? Including the person wearing it? Also, did you see? How come he can't wear it? Why does it say cargo on his name? Maybe he can't wear it because he's not a solstice mage. Where are we going? Input lag. That was a good three seconds. Hi, friend. Can I catch them unawares by doing this? Nope. An achievement, I can't even read it because locksmith, that's all I gotta read.
Ooh, super power. Oh, dicks. Ow. his I don't, like i struggle with the other twos but his nail him look the angled sprite of walking amazing Ooh, rainbow conch that's probably something you sell. Need a book. Made a shortcut? Yes, nice. Ooh, potatoes? I was right, potatoes. Oh, ninja friend! Please be a friend. Whoa, it's a collie! Oh, she's green. That means she's evil. Ah! Oh. Don't do that to me. She looks cool. Wait, where am I supposed to go? Oh. I thought this was the same area because the fish thing was in the same spot. <gasps> Excuse me. Book! All right, we found the moorlands. And I think that's where we're going to call it for the day, my friends. I very much love this game so far. It's it's great. I'm going to spend a little time here after stream to see if I can get the, uh, the controller working because I'm guessing later on in the game, like it, it did say that the timing of blocks and stuff isn't necessary. Like, don't feel bad if you're not doing it. But I do feel like it's going to play a decent role in the game. Uh, right. So... Um, I don't want to deal with input lag fucking me over because it'll drive me nuts. Um, so I'm going to try to see if I can get this hooked up and working. We haven't used it in a while. Maybe that's just why it's not working. But, Reg, thank you so much for contributing. Uh, how how close are we on that Valorant challenge? Because, uh, look at him. He's eating, a, he's eating a thing. He just ate an apple. He cut it with a little knife. Um, okay, so what's the plan? So tomorrow, the plan is we're going to be playing some more uh, Baldur's Gate 3 collab with uh, Cozy Goldfinch, our dear friendly. Um, really excited for that because we, we just stumbled across something. Oh, we're, um, we we did some repair on Carlac and she's getting all happy and we love it. So there, there's, I think we're going to be hitting a next point in the story. I think we're heading to the Moonrise Towers or something, which is funny because moon stuff in this game. Um, so I'm excited for that. Uh, plan is to continue playing on friday um if i am up for it uh maybe we'll do some weekend stuff uh maybe continue the dark urge play i ended up um re making another dark urge character um because i didn't quite fully understand what the dark urge meant um i knew like that you would have dark options and stuff before you but i didn't know um that some of those options would be taken regardless of your input so I'm thinking with Nyx, um, cause I, I designed her to like combat the dark urge. Like she's going to fight against it the best she could. Um, and, but then I also feel like I'm missing out on content by not playing the dark urge the way it's meant to be played is not the right way, but, but to give into those urges to get some of that content that the character is built around. Right. Um, so I ended up re-rolling, making a whole new character. So now we'll have a character that will give in to the dark urge and stuff, which could just be a horrible chaos, awful run. Um, so I don't know how that's going to work, but I will feel better about feeling bad. If that makes sense. Because when Nyx does something bad, I feel terrible and I wish my character didn't do it. This character, I may feel bad, but I like the character would totally be like, fuck yes. So I don't know. Um, so now we're going to, possibly have three campaigns. I don't think I want to do all three at once. Plus that could just get confusing for not only me, but for everyone. And I don't know if you guys want that much Baldur's Gate content, but I'm absolutely loving that game. It's so good. And the 
Larian's amazing. They're constantly pushing out. They're already on their fifth patch, I think. They're constantly pushing out stuff. They're putting stuff in. Uh, they're listening to the community. They respect their players. I love Larian. I want to give them all the support I can. And um, they're just giving us things that they're like, oh, you guys want this? All right, cool. Let's flesh this out better. And I'm all for that. So I want to experience that. Um, next week, the plan is to start Cave the Diver as well. I've heard a lot of good stuff about that. I know Kim's been playing it. Um, Yuri gifted it to the channel, so we'll be checking out. This. So thank you again, Yuri, for that. Um, and then beyond that, uh, Screamed Hober is right around the corner. So if you guys have not yet already, if you check out the Discord, there's a vote in there about a bunch of... I think there's like seven or eight scary games that I own uh, that we haven't played that are in the Game Vote channel. You guys can go vote on the scary games you guys want to see me play this year and uh we'll just run down the list of the well, the ones that show up we will be playing homebody though because uh the grump fam were so kind enough to gift me a key so that one will be played regardless but uh anyways my friends thank you guys so much for hanging out with me remember to spay new to your pets adopt don't shop donate to rescue if you can afford it or open up your house up to the possibility of fostering that is a very rewarding experience it helps those animals and risks out there very much need anyways i am Vasive. thank you guys so much for letting me be your stream tonight i heavily appreciate it and i'll catch y'all next time see ya yeah 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 let's go get some booties let's go come on